Back, 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 back. Check it here. Bring you another Boom Beach video. In today's video, guys, we've got some announcements to make, um, some plans to plan, and uh, just hold on a second here. <clears throat> so yeah, so so we have. Um, so I was talking about before doing the Beardaholic Mega Crab Challenge. So it's it's changed a little bit, guys. What's actually going to happen is we're going to be doing a, like a bunch of different YouTubers uh, are going to be doing a challenge. We're going to get. Uh, Get hammerhead going here. Um, so basically, how the challenge is going to work, guys, is it's um, it's going to um, it's going to be whoever can get the farthest without losing three attacks uh, retreats count as a loss. So you can't retreat uh, if you bring the wrong troops set up for a specific base, then you're done, and uh, you lose the challenge. So this works really well because um, I'm going to be trying to go as far on Mega Crab as humanly possible. Um, <clears throat> I can get into my plan a little bit there in a second, but uh, it really lines up lines up well with that. Um, as far as the beard beardaholic challenge, we're still gonna do that, but we're gonna do it at a later date, and it's going to be like um, it's not gonna be a mega crab thing because if we like the original challenge was to do all zukas on stages 23, 24, 25, but if they're not zuka friendly, then I'm just gonna waste attacks doing it, and I don't want to miss out on. Um, like I don't want to uh, 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 delay my progress just because of uh, just because of that. So we're gonna be doing something else. Um, it's just gonna be full bore, full crab. It's gonna be awesome, guys. I can't wait. I'm so excited. Um, yeah. So my plan for the crab is, um, like I said, I'm gonna try to get as far as possible. Um, I'm 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 gonna be um, probably using a lot of a lot of power powder. Like I'm thinking 30 a day at least, so 30, 60, 90. I might use 100 powder this weekend, depending on how long the um, the attacks last. Uh, I think it was uh, two and a half hours per eight attacks last time, or something like that. Uh, you see, if I actually got a new hammerman base going on here, I just set this up uh, right now, so I'm hoping that it does well. I don't I, I don't think it will. I think I need a damage amp for the rocket launchers, but um, like we're on stage two and they're already getting pretty far back. So I don't think it's gonna work, but uh, I am excited to try, try it out nonetheless. And Mr. Crab, two days, 10 hours guys. So that's Friday, 6 p.m. The crab drops. Uh, I'm gonna be doing a live stream. I'm gonna live stream the crab as soon as it lands down. Um, so ho hopefully you guys tune in for that. Uh, I'm super excited for it. I think that's going to be the best way to do it because I don't want to do like a, I don't want to like do a video of like the first five stages and then by the time it's out I'm already on like stage 20. Like I want you guys to be with me as like we progress together and we can kind of like help each other out if we get stuck on stages or whatever. Like you can watch me, you can give me advice, uh, vice versa. Um, I think that's going to be the best way to do the uh, the crab. I might just do the one live stream then the rest turn into videos. I don't know, whatever. Um, let me know down in the comments what you want to see regarding that. Uh, but definitely when it lands down Friday 6 p.m. Chicken live stream, first live stream. Definitely join me for that, guys. It's gonna be a lot of fun, and um, and yeah. <clears throat> Another thing I was thinking about: um, mega crab statues. Mega crab statues. So I'm gonna slow this down a bit here. Um, so oh no, the horse is going left. No, no, don't do that. Okay, so I gotta put something up to to distract them from going to the left. I think because they probably enough of them take down the HQ. I guess. Um, but yeah, Mega Crab Statue, since I'm going to be using Armored Troops for the most part, like, um, I should probably put a defense over on the left. Um, since I'm going to be using Armored Troops, I'm thinking of putting down another Troop Health, because I just got another Max Troop Health Guardian recently. So, I've got, I've, I actually scrapped it, because I've already got two in the storage, so I don't need any more than that. Um, let's put this up here, stupid warriors. Uh, maybe I'll put a Flamethrower? Or machine guns? The machine guns in the back of this aren't really doing anything, so maybe I'll move them over there. I'm not sure why they went left. Um, uh, so maybe I'll maybe I'll be better off just to shift some stuff over. Um, like this guy, maybe. I think it was this one, too. I probably don't need him so, uh, so far up there. Uh, where can we put you? I can move this over here, and this guy I'm just going to throw right back there. Uh, I think that should do it. I mean, even if they land on the right, I think they'll come over, so we'll see. Um, but yeah, so I'm thinking of swapping out a damage for a true health guardian. Um, I'm not sure exactly. I might cheat a bit and wait till the Australian people, because they're going to get it first, right? Because they're like in the future or something. So I might get them to, um, like I might look at some of those videos first. 
and uh, just see like what it looks like if it's gonna be like Zuka friendly or if it's gonna be like more about uh... damn it the water is still going to the left okay I gotta put something out there to uh... I think I need to put the buildings that are on the HQ I think I need to like make them in a line so if, even if they start at the left they get sucked over to the right um, so we'll speed it up there and uh, yeah so I'm thinking about putting a guardian out for health I'm gonna wait and see. Uh, I don't want to put it out right now just because uh, I'm finding Max Guardians are a lot harder to come by recently than they used to be for some reason. I don't know why, but um, I used to get a Max Troop Damage Guardian. Like, I'm sure I've crushed close to 15 of them. Like, I used to get one like at least once every two weeks. Like, which I guess was kind of crazy. Like, maybe my luck's just running out. Okay, so this is how we're gonna do this, guys. I'm gonna go something like something like that. Just anything to suck them over to the right. Um, I'm thinking that should be okay. Um, now, the problem is, I don't want to put a bunch of stuff, like I was thinking about moving some stuff out where these statues are, but then I don't want to suck the ones that are on the right out back to the left. Um, so we'll try that, we'll see if it does okay. I think a damage amp would do better for this, and um, for this layout, because I've got everything so stacked together. Uh, okay, so... Hmm, those tanks are the stuff to the left. I swear to god the warriors run straight up the left again. Okay, only four of them, that might not be enough. No, oh, it probably will be. Um, whatever. But uh but yeah, let me let me know down in the comments what your uh crab statues are gonna be guys. Uh definitely interested to hear that. So I think what I'm gonna do here is actually swap um I gotta put some kind of defense over there, right? Because they're getting all those free buildings, and because um, they're getting all those free buildings, and that's actually taking a lot of health off the HQ. He might not actually get this. <clears throat> no, he's not going to get that. There's only one. Look at him just smashing that pumpkin. Jeez, it's not freaking. It's not Halloween yet, Warrior. You can't be going around smashing pumpkins. That's what he's trying to do, though. Look, he's just beating the hell out of that pumpkin. Okay, okay, okay. All right, so. We finally got past stage four, so I guess this base kind of sucks, but uh, that's okay. We'll make a couple tweaks to it. Um, what can we do here? Um, maybe we'll just get lucky and not get a warrior drop right on the left or like something stupid like that. Um, so yeah, so for the starting stages, um, like I just kind of implied there, all oh, these right are all going to the left, aren't they? No, okay, we're all good. Um, the starting stages, all my. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna have Scorcher Tank loaded up, so if you weren't sure about what to load, like that should uh, that should do you okay for the beginning. Um, like at least stages one through fifteen, um, and then once I get past stages one through fifteen, I think I'm gonna have to use um, probably Heavy Zuka, um, just because I'll need um, I'll need the extra damage. I think. Uh, okay, so what do we got going on here? Uh, stage six. Uh, stage 5 went down pretty good, so yeah, I guess it just depends if we get a stupid uh, stupid drop or not. Now, I put these mines here because there's not really any defenses that can be barraged around them, so I'm hoping that uh, they like have to walk through them. I wasn't expecting a full-on Zooka drop. I kind of wrecked my uh, my beach setup. Uh, that's okay, though. As soon as they touch the, the rockets, they'll go down. Or the hot pot, whatever. It comes first. Oh, no. So they, they took out that building before the other ones could actually get to it. All those mines worked really well right there. Um, yeah, I think there's too many riflemen on the left side for this to work, unfortunately. Uh, we'll see if we can clear all the stuff on the right, though. With it, oh, these freaking grins. God, I hate grenadiers so much. Um, we got the one shock launcher left. I don't have enough boom cans. I, I gotta move some boom cans to the back, I think. And um, I gotta stop the riflemen from going out to the left. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna start with the uh, Scorcher tank and then just kind of uh, adjust from there as needed. Um, okay, so boom cannons I need in the front more. Uh, do we have any more boom cannons? I got the one on the beach, which I probably probably isn't doing much considering Zookas are coming out first. Um, what can I put uh, out on the beach to stop the Zookas right away? Probably this, maybe this mortar? Uh, I'll move this guy back, and then I'll stick another mortar in here, and I think that should uh, that should help clearing out the Zookas right away, because obviously the flamethrowers aren't going to touch them. 
Um, uh, I think I think that might be okay. We gotta fix the rifleman. Uh, the rifleman coming there too early uh, to the left. So I think we'll move this in a little closer, and maybe that'll kind of suck them in uh, more to the right side. Uh, we'll try and see if it works, guys. If not, it's just hammering, so whatever. Um, but yeah, that's basically that's basically my plan for crab, guys. So YouTuber challenge: uh, Who can get the farthest without dropping three stages? There's gonna be a bunch of people doing it. I don't even know who's all gonna be in it yet. Um, <coughs> excuse me, it's not like 100% set in stone, but I'm pretty sure this is what the plan's gonna be. I messaged Beardaholic last night, so hopefully he uh, gets back to me soon on that to see if he's uh, okay with it and everything. Okay, so we got the two riflemen on the left. That's okay. That's all right. Uh, what else do we got going on here? Uh, lots of medics still up. That was a bad shock. Oh wow. Yeah, that was a really bad shock. Um, damage amp would probably be best for this base. Uh, okay, we got the medics going on the left. That's fine. Go out to the rifleman on the left. That's perfect, actually. Uh, I need I need higher up boom cannons for the grins. Uh They're just doing way too much work. Now there's so few of them. It might take them a while to do enough damage, I'm thinking, maybe? Like, it could be close. Oh, look at how much little health they have. Oh, I think we're gonna do it, I think we're gonna do it. Wow, that sniper clutched up for us. Wow, it took her like six grins, that's crazy. Okay, we got two riflemen on the HQ. There's no way they're gonna take it, there's no way they're gonna take it. All right, stage seven, bring it on, bring it on. <coughs> yeah, so, YouTuber challenge. I'm gonna be live streaming the crab when it drops, so check out uh, check out that, and we can kind of like go through the stages together and um, just help each other out. Um, I don't I I probably I'll probably do the first like few stages unboosted because I I don't need to waste boost uh, on like my first eight attacks. Like I'm sure I'll be able to uh, to be fine without them. Okay, so what do we got for stage seven today, guys? Tons of riflemen, tons of grens. No medics though. No medics. No scorchers. That's good. Uh, we'll see. He'll probably wreck us the first time. We'll have to adjust. So, I don't have that much gold left, so I can't go. Uh, I can't do too many adjustments here. So we gotta actually kind of watch how this plays out. Holy freaking barrage! Jesus, he just took out like half my defenses. That's not exactly fair, Hammerin. Back, back, back. I'll speed up a little bit here. Uh, but yeah. So the challenge, the live stream, uh, the statues. That's gonna be. Uh, that's probably going to be changed during the live stream if I uh, decide to change them at all. Uh, I still kind of like 541 for a uh, Scorcher tank. Oh Jesus, that was a bad drop. Yeah, okay, so we're done here. <laughs> that's, the, that's the end of that. Um, I was not expecting that to happen. Whoa, 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 okay, we, we just got absolutely wrecked here, guys. Just friggin' wrecked. Um, so we'll try it. We'll try it one more time. Uh, we need to get... I don't know, I thought this base was better, but it seems like something like more in the middle. Um, with like things going around both sides might be the best. Uh, I don't have any stage like that, unfortunately. It's going to take way too much time to uh, to um, to make another one like that. Uh, so what we'll do here is... I think what I'll try is maybe I'll put the rocket launchers in the center. Um, far enough away to uh, to not draw them in. From the left side, but center, centered enough that they'll like constantly be spewing out damage. Uh, I think that might help a little bit, guys. Um, also, my stuff might just be too far back. I think it might be better front loaded because when they're on the beach, um, when they're walking to their flags, they're not shooting right. So it's nice to pick off a few there if, if it's possible. Um, so, come on. Good God, what are you doing? You up here. Good boom cannon. Um, yeah, so we'll try something like this. We'll try something like this. Maybe I'll switch the hot pot and the machine gun. Yeah, we'll see how that goes. I'll try it a couple more times, and if not, then uh, then that's gonna wrap up the video today. Um, so we'll see. Uh, we'll see where where they're going here. Um, out to the right. Holy barrage! Jesus. That's crazy. He, he just threw like six barrage. He took out all my defenses. How? Like I have zero chance now. And wow. Okay. So Herman, the uh, the GBE expert. That's crazy. Okay. I'll try one more time on fast speed, and then that's gonna be it. <clears throat> like I just can't. 
We can't do with that much barrage, guys. That's crazy. I'll move the shock launchers out here because I need them. I don't know if this is going to work. I can tell you that right now. Um, but yeah, I'll do this one last one and then that's going to be it. <clears throat> but yeah, super excited for the crab, guys. I can't wait. Um, I wanted to let you guys know about the challenges in the live stream and, uh, and all that stuff. And uh, yeah, like I said, if, if I do switch out a statue, I'm probably going to do it during the live stream. Um, while we're kind of figuring out what's going to be best for the bases. Okay, Hammerman. Okay. Okay. That's it. White flag. Where's the where's the white flag? We're, we're waving the white flag, guys. Waving the white flag. RIP chicken. Hammerman, you've done us today. You've absolutely done us in. And uh, yeah, that's going to wrap it up for the video today, guys. Make sure to leave a like if you found it interesting, entertaining, or informative. If you're looking forward to the live stream, uh, definitely let me know. Um, let me know if you if you think the YouTube uh, challenge thing is a good idea, um, and yeah, let me know you're starting uh, troop levels for the crab stage. Just let me know everything that you're planning for the crab. I want to know all of it. I want to know all of it. And uh, that's gonna wrap it up for the video today, guys. We'll see you in the next one. Chicken out.